Hey guys, thanks for clicking on the video. Today we're going to be unboxing the Tackle Depot 75 Mystery Tackle Box. Uh, sorry, Mystery Box 75. Inside here, there is said to be over $150 worth of tackle in this box. They have three different sizes, the 30, the 50, and the 75. Uh, each box is apparently the same size. Just the other ones, you can kind of hear the rattling inside, you know, the amount of space in this one. This one, you can hear stuff, but you can tell this is packed. Spoiler alert, I have opened this already earlier. Reason being is I wanted to go around online, find the average price uh, for each lure, make a list so I can let you guys know what the price was. Uh, again, it's an average price. I know you can get things on sale a lot cheaper. I did see, you know, scattered prices everywhere. Some things you might even say, hey, that's more expensive somewhere. Just an average price that I did a quick search online. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go over this box. Um, every single piece in here, I'm telling you now, is quality tackle. So please stay watching. Let's open it up. Okay, so I got this box ordered two days ago. I ordered a new finesse spinning rod. I got this box with it. Shipping from Taco Depot, it was two days to my door. It was actually less than two days. I could not believe how fast it came here. Very excited. So let's get into this box. I'll open it up. I'll take a look at each item. Uh, I'll try to let you know what price, like I said, I found. And we'll go from there. So let's get into it. As you can see, I, I spent, like I said, I already opened this box. It took me forever to get it back in the box, just to give you guys an idea of, of how it was. So let's start off here. So we have some VMC Finesse Rugby Jigs, 3 16th of an ounce. I've seen a lot of guys in videos using these lately. Pretty excited for these. It's uh, just one of those things that I don't uh, go to the tackle shop and think to buy. So something new for me to try. That says it has a three degree offset point on them. Uh, you can kind of see it a little bit. I'm assuming that helps hold the fish on a little bit. Uh, but anyways, uh, a great little item to have here. So the, the price I did find on these was $8.99. Next in the box, I watched other unboxings from Tackle Depot. This seemed to be in almost every box I saw. And every time I saw it, I was like, what the heck is that? Anybody actually looking at them didn't realize what they were or anything really. They didn't really know. Uh, so having a look at them, basically it's a, a fluttering spoon that you would attach your Cinco to or your, your Robo Worm, whatever. Um, kind of helps it flutter down a bit, gives it a little bit of flash. I think it's really cool, really. It's 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 pretty smart. Um, I definitely think it's something I'm going to use, so I'm, I'm pretty excited for that. So it's a 1 8 ounce. Um, as you can see from the picture, basically, the way you rig it on there. I just think it's neat. I think the smallmouth are going to love that. So the price I did find on these, uh, the gliding jig, uh, on sale for $4.49, regular price $7.99. Next, we have a Freedom Swing Jig. I did pick a bunch of these up last year. As a little, a, a well, uh, sorry, along with some six inch Kitex and some four inch Kitex. I enjoy pike fishing as well. And for me, I caught a ton of pike on these. These, these things are next to indestructible. The, the hooks are interchangeable on the heads. There's actually a way to uh, just screw them off so it's easy change out on the hooks. You keep the head, away you go. Amazing, I absolutely love them. These are from Freedom. This one's a 3 8 of an ounce. What also came in the box with it was a, um, a swim jig style one uh, with a skirt. Again, 3 8 of an ounce. So when I looked up the prices for these, it was a little strange because when I found the price for the swim jig with the skirt, I found the price at $5.39. And then when I found the price for without the skirt, it was actually $8.95. 
kind of weird, but uh, anyways, those are the prices I found. Um, but very cool, excited to have those. Next we have, this is something a little different. I don't know if it's something I use, maybe. Maybe if I decide to do some uh, some perch fishing, maybe. I guess you can catch walleye on it too. Um, tiny little old school style spoon, I guess. It's called the Quick Fish K3. Uh, high action wiggling plug. Never used one. I've obviously seen them. Kind of a, I guess, older fisherman, uh, older style of fisherman kind of thing. Um, the, the ones I did find of this online were bigger, uh, so the price I ended up giving for this was $4. Next we have the Lunker Hunt Customs. So this is the uh, swim head, basically like a Kitex style, um, soft plastic with a jig head, uh, swim style head. Great little finesse style swim bait. I definitely see myself using this a lot. I, use, I fish a lot of muddier water, so the black and blue is uh, definitely what I'm looking for. Uh, great color. So this is in a quarter ounce, three and a half inches. Um, great set for sure. The price I found for these, and uh, pardon me, so I got a paper on the side. I've been looking at to find this stuff. Um, was seven eighty seven. Now these, I was pretty excited of, um, some Gamagatsu Finesse Heavy Cover Hooks, Worm Hooks. They are three aught. There's four per package. They've got a great little keeper on them. Um, I'm assuming the rubber helps too. I've never actually bought these before, so I know how good of a brand they are. I was shocked when I found the price for these and saw it. I wasn't, I had to look twice because I was like, oh my goodness, uh, $10.99 per pack. Well, that's uh, it's pretty crazy to me, but that's the, the price I saw. Next, we have Eagle Claw uh, Jig Heads, quarter ounce. It's a 10 pack uh, in red. I know uh, a lot of people walleye fish with these. I don't do a ton of walleye fishing, unless it's hard water, I guess. Something I'll use, maybe not, but uh, it's always something good to have in the tackle box. Next, when I saw these, I just thought they were cool. Haven't heard the company before, but these are the Mud Skipper Gobi. So this is by Mismo. Uh, I haven't heard of the company before. I did end up finding them online. These are a five inch uh, goby, look like a finesse goby. Open them up and look. These are just cool. Actually hollow bodied. And look at this tail, like just me holding it. How much action that has. I'm trying to hold it as still as I can. I can just see these being absolutely phenomenal. So pretty excited about that. So Mud Skipper Gobi by Mismo. If you've heard of the company before, uh, say something in the comments there. Let me know if you use them and how you did with them. Uh, again, excited to try. So what I did find these for were actually $4.89 American. I'm in Canada, so probably roughly translates to around $7 or so. Next. This is something I wasn't too excited about, but uh, here it is, a Sub-Zero Game Fish Tip-Up Rig. I haven't used one before. Will I use it? Yeah, maybe. Basically, it's a, a braided steel line leader with a small treble hook, looks like a you know, number six or something on there. A uh, little like Colorado style blade on there. Um, yeah, it's, it's just something different. There's two pieces in there. Um, number eight, high test strength braid wire, super sharp. Yeah, so anyways, something different. Oh, the price I found for these was uh, 
I definitely wouldn't pay that, but to each their own. Next, we have a Storm Smash Shad Rattling Floating Crankbait. Uh, pretty neat color on it. I'm, uh, I'm always a fan of trying new colors and stuff. You, you never know what's going to work. Some people want to match the hatch and all that, um, which absolutely works for sure. But you never know when one's going to look at something new and be like, yes, I want to eat that. So this one is a 6 foot to 12 foot uh, swim depth, which is pretty good. A uh, little, uh, probably three and a half inch, I'd say. Mm, I don't really see anywhere. That'd be my guess, maybe three and a half inch. Anyways, pretty neat. So Storm, again, another good brand. As you can see so far, everything is a name brand item, which is fantastic. I've uh, had tackle subscriptions from uh, a Lucky Tackle Box. Um, did I get my money's worth out of the Lucky Tackle Box? Yeah, I did, but... A lot of it you could tell was uh, stuff you could buy on Alibaba that they just put their own name brand spin on. This stuff is true quality name brand stuff, so pretty excited about that. This here is a live target uh, popper frog. So the uh, coppers, I guess they call it. Um, something different. It's, it's got some... Uh, like a little finesse top water bait, uh, kind of neat. So this one's a two and a half inch, uh, quarter ounce. It's got the realistic leopard frog look to it. Just pretty neat. Again, another great bait. Um, I found this one and I, I thought it was a little expensive. Again, like I said, I just looked for a few prices at a, a couple of different places. It said $16.49. I think that's a little high. I could see the $10 mark or something. I know it's live target that the brand's getting a lot of traction and attention the last few years, um, especially at iCast and stuff. But yeah, that, that seems a little ridiculous. Um, but again, a very cooler, very cool. Uh, back to the storm shad. I didn't say the price, but I'm sure you guys saw it. $7.99 for that. Get deeper into this box. Okay, next we have Live Target Twitch Minnows. These look very cool, very realistic looking. I don't know if I'm getting a good image on my uh, GoPro here or not. Uh, very realistic looking, nice soft plastic. I think this is going to be great for uh, maybe like a heavier drop shot style. Uh, it, yeah, just it, it looks great. Three and three quarter inch, uh, very natural looking. I, I think it's going to uh, definitely do the job for sure. So again, live target, Twitch Minnow. The price I found on these was ten ninety nine. Again, a little high for you know, four baits, but um, yeah, yeah, live target. Their, their prices are getting up there. I think uh, to me, you know, I might pay five ninety nine for that. But anyways, again, those are the prices I found. This I was super excited to see. Guggen baits, not something I see in my area. I know they're in Canada now and there's some places you can get them and you can order them online, uh, but not something I see in stores, which is typically how I like to shop for the most part. Uh, so these are the rattling neds. Ned fishing is, uh, ned rigging is something I wanna get into this year. I just, I see a lot of people with great success with it, which is actually why I got that new finesse spinning rod um, which i will show in another video do a review on it actually after i've had a chance to use it anyways so guggen baits rattling neds eight in there and listen great little rattle action on that so very excited for this they're called uh new money that's the color so it looks like uh you gotta get like a a very vibrant green on the back there with a little bit of red flake so, yeah, pretty cool. Two and three quarter inch, soft texture. Got a little rattle chamber in there. Very cool, very excited. The price I found on these was $9.89. Again, yeah. But uh, with, with, the, with the rattles built in and stuff, you know, you got that secondary action, so to speak. Um, it doesn't seem that bad, so. Okay, we're starting to get down to the bottom of the box now. 
as you can see how small this box was and how much was in there it's pretty crazy so another live target like i said a lot of good name brand stuff in here bait ball series jerk bait this uh has a dive depth of three to four feet um this one uh, did get best new bait in iCast 2013, which it says. I bought two of these last year and haven't used them yet. I'm a, I am kayak fish. That's what I enjoy doing. So I, I normally fish shallow. I do want to start fishing deeper water. So get into more jerkbait style fishing and uh, crankbait, stuff like that. So this is definitely something cool that I'm excited to try. Uh, what do we have here? So it's... Uh, Dive depth of three to four feet, size is four and a half inch, and it's a five eighths ounce. Um, color is pearl bright green. The price I found on this was $16.99, and I know I've definitely seen it for that price in stores quite a bit. When I purchased mine, I believe I got them on sale for $10.99 each. So, but anyway, $16.99 average price. Um, got a rattle in there too, by the sounds of it. Yeah. Um, anyways, another great bait in this box. So last but not least, I was so excited when I saw this because it's something I want to be getting into. A swim bait, live target, again, another live target, just some great stuff. Um, the Golden Shiner. So this is a great soft, soft swim bait, paddle tail on it. The uh, dorsal fin here actually acts as a weed guard for the hook, um, very cool, very realistic looking really for uh, a soft black, or soft bait. Um, so it says natural profile, factory rigged, uh, debris shield, what they're calling the, the dorsal fin, and then oscillator tail, like a, a paddle tail. Um, it's a five and a half inch, inch and three quarter. So it's, it's heavy, that's for sure. Um, I don't really have a swim bait rod yet. I do have my uh, heavy fast frogging rod. It's just, this is still a little much for that, I guess, but I, I could get away with it. Um, so again, something new, something different for me, something I wouldn't normally go out and buy. So it's just a, an absolute great selection from this box. As you can see, the, the amount of stuff that we pulled out of here, and I will, Kind of spread it out and, and give you a better view of everything again here before we stop the video. Um, is it worth it? Well, let's take a look. So again, just by the numbers that I looked at quickly, I have a value total here of $165.41 for a box that would typically cost $75. It's, it's unbelievable. Um, Apparently every box you get from them is completely different. There's no box alike. Um, some have stickers, some have beer cozies in them. Um, I would definitely love to get another box from these guys again. Absolutely worth it. Uh, I've looked at many other tackle subscription services and, and nothing close to this. And the great thing about this too, there's no contracts, there's no commitments. You buy one box at a time if you want. You know, maybe one month you want a $30 box, next one you want the $75, you want the $50. Get what you feel like, get what you can afford at the time, or, uh, you know, just try something new. Absolutely amazing. I'm, I'm super happy with it. So I'm going to lay this all out. Um, we'll get a good shot of everything again. And, uh, yeah, just, just absolutely excited about all this. So here we have it. One last glance of everything. Get an idea of it all. I still couldn't believe this was all crammed into that little box. And like I said, when I went to repackage this up, because I had had it open before to get pricing, um, <laughs> it took me a while to get all this back in there. Like, I don't know who's packing these boxes over there at uh, Tackle Depot, but you guys are doing a great job, that's for sure. Um, again, super happy with this stuff. And, uh, definitely look forward to uh, seeing another box. So there we have it. That was the uh, Tackle Depot Box 75. Amazing value. Super happy with it. Super excited to try every single bait and product that's in there. Um, I do a lot of kayak fishing. So if you guys are really interested in that at all, uh, please subscribe, follow the channel, and uh, I hope to upload a, a lot more videos coming up. 
So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.